Yeah! Yeah, it be me! It be I! Hold on. To the millions! Of Juice World fans, man, y'all read the title of the video. Y'all already know what we're talking about, man. These are, this is more Juice World song predictions. Songs that I think, in my personal opinion, that should be on the party never ends. And honestly, I only, I think I'm gonna just say about eight songs and actually just ask your guys' thoughts and opinions towards about those eight songs. I may do three or four, depending on the length of the video. But hold on, wait. But hold on, wait. I'm about to make y'all proud with the sub count. I'm about to make y'all proud man whoa 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 and whoa oh oh hey man i ain't about to hold y'all man we are 100 subs away from 4,000 on youtube which is cool it's cool we got 13 we got two accounts on tiktok with over 13,000 people on them bro this is nothing new to us bro and obviously man I really do want to say thank y'all for the love and support and everything that y'all been doing upon me posting shorts. Obviously, this is how I'm going to be doing it from now on. Since shorts will become so much more important on YouTube in 2023, I am taking full advantage as much as I can. The ultimate goal is to not have any of my videos get completely blocked. Anything that can lead to a strike on my page. I don't want the beef. I don't want to deal with none of that, man. So I'm going to try to avoid, but I do want to put y'all on the songs so that there is a slight risk and that's why there's the patreon and other subscription based pages to where it's more worth me putting out that content obviously all i need to do is just update the content especially if you hit me up in discord man i got you so the first song i really want to talk about is my bad now this song I don't hear people talk about and, and there's a reason I don't hear people talk about this song I have my list right here I'm gonna be writing down you know the songs that I'm talking about but nobody talks about these songs nobody uh, uh, says anything about anything Nick Mir made in terms of a beat that Juice World has rapped on it's crazy to me because if you've heard my bad for the first time I'm gonna leave a link to it Bro, it went crazy. It's hard. It's a top tier song. Like, I want to put more people on to Juice World songs, but not just anything that's sad or that it puts anybody at a low vibration. I want everything to also just feel like it's in a good mood. And then also, this is my opinion for songs to be on The Party Never Ends. So, duh, I'm going to put my thoughts and opinions on certain things, especially when it comes down to songs. But... Apart from 67, I want to do Soda Pop. Now, now they say Soda Pop has a feature with Rod, Rod, Roddy Rich. I don't want to hear that. Like, I, I'm so serious, but I'm not even about to hold you. We already said on a short, but I'm saying 99% of all Juice Pro songs where it's just him by himself. They go hard. They're top five songs. They're good songs. Anything that he has a feature with based on or anybody that he has a feature with it depends anything that he did with young thug has gone crazy some of the songs he did with g herbo you're gonna have to pick and choose that's just what it is and then he has a slew of other features he's done with ski mask all those songs go hard but i'm just saying you have to pick and choose with the features that juice world has and then adding certain people on to certain songs it definitely definitely depends but hey on to another song so we did my bad and soda pop but the next song i want to talk about is game now game is, is it, it, i think it deserves a little bit more praise because i don't hear these songs talked about and then you'll notice a theme also within this video in terms of songs that i'm picking that i think deserve just a spot on the party never ends all of this is just my opinion all of this is opinion based you can let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments if you made it this far but let me know if you've heard game do you think it deserves a spot on the party never ends am i out of my mind for saying that game deserves a spot on the party never ends let me know your thoughts man because these songs in my genuine opinion just need a listen and for somebody that doesn't listen to Juice World, or for someone that you know isn't that big of a Juice World fan, they don't know what the hype is, they don't know what all the fuss is about. Putting them on a, these certain songs that I'm saying, there's a reason. Dude, that may get somebody hooked forever. That may put somebody on for for 
who knows how long because juice world's music is so you know it just get in it gets into your pores it makes you it changes your mood that's why i want it to all be good music not not nothing too sad not i mean every song the common theme is he talks about his drug use that's cool okay but how's the vibe of the song we already know what songs some of the songs that we're getting at least we already know and then they may throw uh um face to face and, and in my head they may throw that on the album also because those are singles that they might as well put on the album you feel me we've discussed and talked about so many of them but two more songs that i would love to talk about right now is ashtray all right now overall if you heard these songs like i want people to just hear a, a snippet not not the full song because that's gonna ruin the vibe that's gonna ruin the feel like oh you already heard it you already know what it is i want people to just hear a snippet of some of these songs and i wish i could put some of the snippets of the songs in this video but i'm just too afraid of having my videos taken down demonetized stuff like that i don't mind on my youtube shorts and stuff like that i'm not in it for the money but when i'm making full length videos like this i want my videos to be monetized man i'm not gonna lie to you and then apart from that hearing ashtray for the first time at least with me i've never I mean, anytime I, I get hooked on a song, I play it back many a time. But it's just, I play this song back for days. Now, normally, I like when I hear one good song, I play it back for like that whole day, maybe. But I was playing this song back for days. And then also, some of these videos or some of the songs I'm talking about are on my YouTube channel, short form, obviously, man. So if you want to hear it or hear a snippet of it, then I, I could do that for you. I'm not going to put any links down because it, that's it's too much. And then the last song that I want to talk about, you know, because this video is running on a tad bit too long, a little bit longer than I like, is Pop It. Now, now. This is a song apparently that Juice World and G Herbo had together that was supposed to be on a freestyle that was actually on a freestyle, uh, I believe, Chris Long's page when Juice World was just rapping from stuff that the old dude done picked up. I think, I'm not 100% sure, I'm not 100% accurate with these things, but this is a freestyle and Pop It definitely deserves to be on A Party Never Ends. If you've never heard the song, which a lot of people haven't heard the song, I have the song, it's in the Discord, and will I just be giving it to anybody? Absolutely not. It's gonna ruin the vibe of the song. It's going I don't want people to hear these songs and hear the whole thing. I want you to hear the vibe of the song just to have a gist of what it would be. But overall, let me know your thoughts and opinions on the songs that we talked about today. You feel me, man? And then overall, let me know your thoughts in the comments, like up the video, get me up in the algorithm, man. Take your time, enjoy yourself, love yourself. Love life, man. Stay motivated. If you need encouragement, I'm here. With all that being said, I'm going to let Dre say, say these final Click on words. this video next. I know if you like this one, you'll love this. And don't forget to comment and let me know your thoughts on the video.